Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate user scraper on Reddit using Socinator. If you're a big fan of a particular Reddit user's posts, then Socinator can help you out in scraping them. Let's start with the Accounts Manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right-click on your Reddit account and hit Go to Tools. It will take you to the Account Configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on Reddit through Socinator. Let's click User Scraper. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to scrape a number of users within a period of time while narrowing them down in the process. There are several configuration categories for User Scraper activity. Let's start with the first one, Search Query. As the name suggests, Search Query allows you to command the software on how to search targeted users to scrape. There are two important sections, Query Type and Query. Query Type defines how you want to search the user. You can select the Query Type by clicking the drop-down button. Once you have chosen your Query Type, enter the query either manually by typing in this area, or you may click this button to import from CSV or text file. Select the right file and click Open. When you're done, click the Add Queries to the List button and it will be added to the Queries list over here. To show you how this works, let's test each query type. For keywords, let's type Memes for example, click Add. So this will target users containing this keyword. Then we have Custom Users List. For this one, we need a specific Reddit user. Let's say you want to target this Reddit user, for example. So copy the user URL here, paste it in the query box, and click Add. So this will target this particular Reddit user. You can add several query types and queries depending on your preferences. If you want to delete a query from the list, simply click the trash bin button on the right side of the query you want to remove. Let's say you want to delete the first one, click it, and it's gone. The next configuration category is Job Configuration. This allows us to choose the speed at which an account should scrape users. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which you can use, like Slow with an average daily activities of 84, Medium with 250, Fast with 417, or super fast with 834. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, click advanced settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each user is scraped. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes the software should pause after scraping the number of users you set in number of user scraper per job. Number of user scraper per job will allow you to specify the number of users you want to scrape per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of users to scrape per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another custom number of users to scrape per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to keep scraping users even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on, let's say, Monday, click the trash bin button under Monday and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday for example, provide the start and end time, let's say 12 a.m. to 1.59 a.m. and click Add Interval and it's added. Let's add another one on the same day. Let's say 2 a.m. to 11.59 p.m. Click Add Interval. So as you can see, we can have several schedules in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite. Let's call it Reddit User Scraper. Click Save. We can then open it by clicking Select Favorite Time and choosing Reddit User Scraper. The next tool is User Filters. This allows us to filter the users we want to scrape on Reddit. Check the first one to target users who are employees. Check the second one to target gold users. Check the third one to target moderators. 
Check the fourth one to target not safe for work users. And finally, you can specify the minimum and maximum number of comment CARM accounts of the users you want to target. Let's say 10 to 20. The last configuration category is post filters. This allows us to filter the posts of the users we want to scrape on Reddit. So check the first one to target sponsored posts. Check the second one to target locked posts. Check the third one to target archived posts. The fourth one will target hidden posts. The fifth one will target roadblock posts. The sixth one will target blank posts. Then the seventh one will target original content. The next one will allow you to specify the gold count in a specific range between two numbers. Next, you can specify the score in a specific range between two numbers. Then the num cross posts in a specific range between two numbers. Then the number of votes in a specific range between two numbers. Finally, you can specify the number of comments the post should have. Let's say 10 to 20. When you're satisfied with all the configurations and are ready to start scraping users on Reddit, let's scroll up and click Save. Success. After saving, let's click the status button to make it active. To view the users you have scraped, click Reports over here. Now, let me show you another option in automating user scraper on Reddit using Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the social drop-down button and select Reddit. This will take us to the Accounts tab. Let's switch to the Scraper tab and select User Scraper on the left side of the app. Here we can name our campaign. Let's call it Reddit User Scraper. For Search Query, let's select Custom Users List as our query type. Then use the same user URL from earlier. Paste it and click Add. For Job Configuration, let's select Slow. For user filters, it's up to you. Then for post filters, let's target those with 10 to 20 comments. When you're ready, let's click the blue button, Select Account or Accounts. In this part, you can select multiple Reddit accounts. Since we only have one account right now, let's go with that by checking the box and click Save. After saving, let's click the red button, Create Campaign. If you want to proceed, click your account and the Save button. This will automatically bring us to the Campaigns tab where you can see that we have successfully created our Reddit User Scraper campaign. Click the Status button to pause the campaign and the Action button over here will allow us to edit, duplicate, or delete the campaign. To view the users you have scraped, click Report over here. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching.